Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and thank you for flying with us on Fort Worth TV Flight 190. The captain has informed me that we are about to arrive at our final destination. The Hops and Props Warbird and Craft Beer Festival at the Fort Worth Aviation Museum. If you look out the window on our approach, you can see helicopter rides, live music, a free museum open house, craft beer tasting, and many more family-friendly events. So please, fasten your seatbelts and return all trays to their upright positions as we learn more about this unique Fort Worth festival. Hops and Props is a, uh, an aircraft fly-in and a craft beer festival. We've decided to combine an, an, uh, an event that has the best of a lot of things that people like. Most of our, our visitors come out to see our airplanes, so they'll have an opportunity to see our airplanes. We're gonna be have an open house for free all day long. And then we also have some special airplanes that are gonna be flying in for the day, so people get a chance to see a bunch of other airplanes. And then in the afternoon, we've got uh, 10 of local brewers from the area here that are gonna uh, come and uh, they're gonna show off their craft beers. In addition, they will have aircraft flights that have beer flights. Beer flights at breweries are the little testers. You get testers of four or five different uh, types of their beer, and they refer to that as a beer flight. So we're going to be offering beer flights on vintage airplanes. Uh, the flagship Detroit is going to be here, and also off of the uh, Southern Cross, which is a, uh, a World War II vintage transport airplane. And so we're going to be selling beer flights on those. And Epic Helicopter is going to be here giving uh, helicopter rides for anybody who'd like to buy a helicopter ride. And we've got family-friendly vendors here. They're going to have about 30 of them or so, bounce houses for the kids. Buffalo West is going to be here, and they're going to be serving food all day. It's a fundraiser for Fort Worth Aviation Museum, so they can continue to do educational programs with local schools and to preserve the history of aviation here in North Texas. The history of aviation here in North Texas goes back 105 years. And starting in 1940, when we started building airplanes here, aviation really changed the whole economy, culture, and the lives of tens of thousands, now hundreds of thousands, millions of people in the area. For instance, from 1950 to 1970, when the B-58 Hustler was being built here, the population of the city increased almost 30%. And that was pretty much all attributable to the B-58. That was the first supersonic bomber ever built in the world, and uh, so Fort Worth was the center of aviation in the entire world at that point in time. There are very few B-58s still around, but there is one available right now in Illinois. It's gonna be very expensive to move it here from Illinois, so we are working very hard to find supporters to help us bring that airplane here so that we can use it as a tribute to not only the people who designed it, built it, flew it, and maintained it, but also as a, as a point of inspiration for young people here and for the city to take some pride in the fact of the things that, that the city has accomplished here. To learn more about Fort Worth Aviation Museum and to purchase the Hops and Props tickets, visit their website. Here's a look at other events happening in and around Fort Worth in the next few weeks. For a listing of more events and city meetings, you always can check the calendar at the city's website.